Hi, Global Tribe. So let's talk about finances in marriage. I know that this is one topic that plenty of people always discuss and they say you must discuss it before you get married. Well, Just as many concepts in marriage, it is different strokes for different folks, you know. Some people love the joint accounting and it works for them. Some people can never do the joint accounting because it just doesn't work for them. Once you get like an equilibrium or a balance, what I would suggest is that you have at least three bank accounts. This means you have your personal bank account, your husband has your personal bank account, and both of you have a bank account that you contribute money together for a goal. So these goal bank accounts can be more than one depending on the things that you're contributing money for. So say you're contributing money for your children's school fees, um, housekeeping, and a building project. I have my bank account, he has his bank account, and we have these three bank accounts that both of us have access to, and we both contribute money to it. And until both of us sign, we cannot take money out of this bank account because it's for a project. So I cannot say that I feel like eating suya and I'll go and take for my children's school fees. That is not gonna be nice, <laughs> you know? So I think that if both partners contribute towards goals in the marriage it can be in different variants somebody 30 percent somebody 70 percent or 50 50 whatever you want to do i think that is going to balance things out and then i have my personal money he has his personal money i don't question his personal money he doesn't question my personal money you know but then when it comes to the projects in the marriage the things we want to do together as partners both of us have a say so i hope this helps